it's Claire from Diamond Painting Nerd and welcome to a little unboxing video. So I have gone a bit cray cray on Shein and I've ordered myself a whole load of new kits and canvases and also some accessories and I thought I'd do an unboxing video. So let's, I'm going to pop the canvases out of the way for just a second and then we will have a look at those. But first of all, I've ordered these bits and bobs. So um, I ordered this, it actually came with a pen as well and it also came with some wax and some um, some of the attachments as well um, but I wanted to um, I wanted to get another tray so the tray that I've got came with my art dot case um, but the grooves I found weren't very deep and so when I was shaking the drills um, they weren't all turning not all of them but they it was really struggling for them all to turn up so I'm hoping that this actually has deeper grooves in that I might have better luck with this one there is a dispenser hole on the side as well so and it also came with a pen a bit of a funky funky design now like I said it came with the heads and also some purple wax which I've um with, which I've yet to come across yet so um I'll try and remember some of the prices I think this was like two pounds in the UK this was like two pounds something three pound maybe so I got that and I also bought these so I have a light pad and um, I found that my project was constantly slipping um, down from the light pad. So I bought these. I was using some bulldog clips, um, but I thought actually I'll get something a bit more substantial um, and bigger. But they are really strong. I've just ended up throwing these across my uh, my desk. So um, it comes as a two pack and I think it was less than two pounds for those. So super value. Now, as I said, I've got an art dot case, but I wanted to try another storage system. Um, so I bought one of these and I think this was five pounds something. It wasn't the cheapest, um, but I wanted just to try another storage system just to make sure I'm happy with the screw lids um, in the art dot box. And let's see how easy these are to actually open. Mm, not very by the looks of things. Oh, goodness me. So, yeah, this is going to be. This is going to be problematic. Um, oh, am I opening it? No, I am opening it the right way. Um, okay. Wow. It might just be that they're they're stiff and they need. Yeah, I, I really can't open. Oh wow. Okay, I, I I yeah, I don't recommend this because nobody has time to be messing around trying to get these little pots open wowzers okay i can already see this is going to really annoy me yeah i'm not so i'm not so happy with that i mean they seem they seem like the lids are going to stay on so i'm not going to have any issues with um the drills falling out but let's try another one and just see if it was well, that one was already open oh see those seem much easier for some reason these ones were really really tough to open but i'll um i'll kit up in this and i'll see how i get on over time with it but yeah that was about five pounds something so not the cheapest but um i just wanted to try another solution and then i also ordered myself a new pen um i have one i ordered from amazon um but this one was like two pounds as well it's really inexpensive it comes with all of the tool heads as well and it's this really nice like a marble blue marble design so yeah there we are so those are the accessories that i bought for my diamond painting now onto the canvases so yeah it's going to be a bit of a long one because this is i bought nine oops um that was a little bit was a little bit exciting and i've already this one is packed in here very very well so this is not going back in let's try and get this out wowzers this is not happening i'm gonna have to open this a little bit this is proper rammed in there we go look that is proper jammed in there so this one is a 30 by 40 this one is a landscape one how exciting and i'm just gonna roll this back to try and get some of these creases out So this canvas is um, not particularly, it's very plasticky, it feels on the back, um, but 
look how beautiful that is this unicorn and i hope that the finished project is as beautiful as um what i can see on here and and on the picture as well yeah that's really going to have to be laid flat i think to try and get some of these creases out um but so this one is a 30 by 40 there are 23 colors we have the legend on both the top and the bottom and then we have the standard pen tray and the wax which i'm not interested in and then we have the colors let's take a look at these this is a this is a round drill so let's get these out of here also has all of the dmc codes on also on both the canvas and also the drill packets so let's go so we have some pink some black some taupe more pink some green goodness me there's a lot of colors in here lots of pink some more green some black and we have another section of some purples and lots of the 3865s so i don't think any of these kits have any um, ab's in at all which i'm not surprised because the kits are so inexpensive that i wouldn't expect oh goodness me i wouldn't expect any of them to actually come with any special drills anyway um so yes i've got this little unicorn let's move that up this little unicorn one um and it's got a little butterfly on as well so actually let's wrap this up i'm gonna leave out the kit and <clears throat> the plastic because hopefully that might make it go back into the packet okay next up i have this one here and this is another 30 by 40 and this one seems actually it doesn't seem as crinkled as that first one let's see if we can get some of these creases out of this lots of black in that standard kit with it as well and let's actually see it says 30 by 40 but um, it's, quite, it's quite a way under. It's 24 and a half by 34 and a half. So yeah, I'm not getting anywhere near the true size, but we don't tend to with these kits, do we, right? So um, yeah, let me just zoom out a little bit so you can see this a bit better. And sorry about the glare on this. I'll try and I'll try my best with um not making it too glary i'll have a look at the drills for this this is another round kit there's 20 colors um on this one so not not a lot of colors in this one there seems to be quite a lot of um quite a lot of the yeah the black and the white at which you would which you would expect so again we've got the dmc codes on the um on the canvas and the, the uh, legend both top and bottom and so let's go we've also got the dmc code no we haven't got the dmc codes on um the packets i'm just gonna have a look at the the quality of these drills they all look to be they all look to be fine i can't see any horrible bits in there so that looks good so yeah no dmc codes on the packets um but the dmc codes are on the canvas so we have some purple some black some gray some more purple some pinks oh some peaches for that one some navy magenta some more pinks like a baby pink an orangey color some purples and then some white so yeah this one Hopefully shouldn't take too long. Now I did a 30 by 40 over the weekend and I got it done in two days. So I know that I can get these kits made up 
fairly quickly the 30 by 40 ones so this one comes in a slightly different plastic bag as well okay and then on to the next one this is another 30 by 40 I'm open sideways okay so we have I just I love I love this one when I saw it I hope the colors are not green on this this one oh so it's two hands and they're holding uh, with little fingers I just love it I wanted this for my bedroom and then we've got the standard um pen and the wax and the tray actually you get a bigger bit of wax in that one and a different tray you get the one with the um the, the, the doodah on the end as well so this is another round drill doesn't seem to be um, an actual choice on Shein with it being a round or a square drill to be honest so I just took what I could get on there and we have again we've got the legend top and bottom we've got a similar canvas they all feel pretty much the same um, now this doesn't actually list the number of colors um, but there are one two three four five six seven eight nine ten eleven twelve thirteen fourteen fifteen colors which i'm really surprised about so i'm hoping that the um the shading on this is going to be brilliant because um it is all in grayscale so it's all black white and gray so i'm hoping the shading is excellent on this um we have the dmc codes on the packets on these ones and uh, i'm just going to take a quick look at the quality of the drills they look fine can't see any nasty bits in there can't really see any hitchhikers at the moment so they all look to be okay so we have a lot of the that's more blue um but we have a lot of grays there's a little bit of a um too short color you'd call that taupe maybe yeah it's got a bit of a greeny tinge to it but again a lot of the whites this whole background it's not a partial these are all full kits um so that's going to be a lot of work with those whites but um i really want to get this one done sooner rather than later because it was one of my favorites that i chose so let's just get rid of these drills and move on next up we have this one and i'm not going to bother measuring the canvases because they all look to be very similar in terms of how much um, is lost on either side and the top and the bottom this is another 30 by 40 and i'm wanting to do this for my craft room this one a nice colorful pop and again we've got the legend top and bottom this has 23 colors we have a lot of that 3865 the white in the background so and then this one actually has come wrapped together as well This one actually has a printed legend. And these bags, oh my goodness me, look. Teeny tiny little bags of drills. Wow, that's the first time I've seen that. Standard um, tray. And yeah, browsers. I've never, I've never seen the tiny packets like this before. So I just hope that there are enough drills in here to finish this. That's my only concern, that there isn't really much room for um, not having enough to get this finished. So, yeah, I'm not going to get all of those out because they're all loose packets. The uh, DMC code is printed on the um, the packets um, and they are, they are all round drills and they... They look okay. The printing on the packets isn't great. So some of them that are quite faded. And there's also a printed legend in this one as well. So, okay, moving on. Next up, we have this one. 
and this one is this one's a 30 by 45 so this one is going to be slightly longer and this is a landscape one as well so this is the phases of the moon and this one is going to be a very tedious because there is a lot of black in this one so we have i'm gonna try and pull this back just to see if i can get this to relax a little bit yeah i don't think that's really helping so nope um it just needs to go under and flat go under a book and flatten out i think um now the legend is only at the top here um there are only eight colors in this um and let's try and get this a roll back see if we can get this straightened a little mm, that's not really much better but we'll see uh standard oh there's some bags in this one as well so you actually get the the zippies in this kit um and here are the drills so we have the dmc codes on the packets and i would imagine there's going to be tons of packs of 310 yep here we are one two three four five six oh my goodness me so yeah most of this is going to be black um in the background there are um i don't think i've seen any of my kits that have actually got the um codes um with the circles on i know that most of the kits are being removed uh the circles are being removed but um this one actually has the circles on i don't know how i feel about that yet until i actually start working on this so we'll see how i get on hopefully it's not going to cause too much of a problem okay next up we have this one which is surprise surprise another 30 by 40 that is the typical size that they offer on there i have got one larger one which i'll show you um, but yeah, I think all of mine, apart that, that moon one, I think was 30 by 45. Um, but these have all, apart from that, these have all been 30 by 40. Oh, if I can get these, this open. Ah, uh, that was getting stuck. That's why. So these have all been poured glue, um, so far purely because of the, um, the, the sheet, the clear sheet that comes with it. It's a dead give giveaway. So... We have, oh goodness me, see it feels sticky up here, so I think something's happened to this. Um, we have this one, I don't know if you can, yeah, you can tell what it's going to be. So we have the Eiffel Tower in the background and there's a couple of couples walking here. I'm not too sure on how um, visible they're going to be seen, they're going to be on here. Um, I think this canvas is probably too small for the detail, um, but there we are. So then we have the standard um, tray and pen and wax. And then we have 25 colours in this one. And the legend is both top and bottom. And again, it's a round drill. OK, the colours in this are absolutely gorgeous. So we don't have the DMC codes on the bags, but we do have it on the canvas. Um, so we have some purple, some grey, some black, more grey, lots of grey in this, um, which is one of my favourites. So that's fine. Grey and pink are my favourite combo. So this canvas really spoke to me. And then we have some more purple and then we have some white and some more shades of purple. Really pretty colours in this one. So this is another one that I'm going to be excited to get started. And then this is the next one. This is another 30 by 40. And this one here is, again, I'm excited to do this one. This one is of uh, London. So you've got Big Ben. I'm not too sure what you can make out here. You've got Big Ben. Um, you've got a bus, I think. And then you've got the big red phone box. So I'm hoping um, that the definition on this really comes through when it's finished. Having said that, there is only 20 colours. There are only 20 colours. So, yeah, I'm not too sure on how, um, how good this one's going to be. The... Um, the legend is only on here once. Oh, that's the other thing I wanted to do is just check. 
that's lovely and sticky so i don't think we're going to have any issues to be fair um no issues so far with the others again another pack of the um the tray and the pen and the wax um and some more baggies which will always come in handy so i'll take those so let's have a look at the drill so another round and uh we have some gray some pink some mauve some green which is strange actually because i actually thought this was uh black and white just with the color popped um phone box on the bus but clearly not because there are other colors in here as well um i'm spotting quite a few hitchhikers in these packets though there's one in there there's one there that i can see um so yeah it's not too much of a problem i just need to grab them out before they um make it into my fitting up um, this packet's got a little bit of a split in it so again they just have to be careful um that those don't start escaping but um yeah it's not what i thought it was going to be it's not what i expected the, pic the picture definitely looked like it was a black and white with um just the phone box and the bus collar popped but there we are it is okay right then we have this one here and now this said new on the website so i wanted one with my initial and all of the ones that they had with the initial were out of stock they just had m s l and a i think um and then i spotted this i looked a little while um, like a few days later and then this said new um so let us have a look now already I know that this is different. This is the this is the, the double sided tape um, because of the backing that's on this. And as a crafter or a paper crafter, I know that this is the protected protective cover for. And you can see, you can actually see where the tape has stretched as well. So yeah, this is a double sided um, tape canvas, not a poured glue. This is the design. Um, it's still a full kit um, so the background I think is all going to be white so that's going to be lots and lots of fun now this canvas feels a bit more rigid um, than the other canvases as well I know you obviously can't see the design but there we are um, again it's not listed on how many colours there are or that I can see uh, no, so we have 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18. So there's 19 colours on this one. Again, the drills come in a separate pack. This is round drill again. I'm wondering whether this might be, I think one of the other ones was new as well. I think this is, might be how they do the new kits. Um, so yeah. So we have the same um, again and look exactly the same again. So tiny little packets of drills. I think they're really narrowing down on how many drills you get um, because I've never seen such a small amount given for any kit um, apart from this and that other one that we opened as well. Yeah, there's a lot of white. Look at all these. This is this is ludicrous. Look at all these packets of white or are they white? three eight six five i think so um look at they don't look very white yeah it's a little concerning look on how many how long is this going to take to open and kit up this is absolutely ridiculous so um yeah i'm not overly happy with how this has been um packaged to be honest because this is absolutely crazy um and this is going to take me forever to open all of these and kit them up um, I would just snip along the top, but my fear is that I'll end up dropping them and they'll go everywhere. There is a printed legend again um, for this one. So yeah, I've got a sneaky suspicion that <clears throat> this and the other one that I opened that had these tiny, teeny little packets of drills in are the new way that they're doing these um, diamond painting kits. So I will keep an eye on it and see if i order i will i probably will order again from Shien. um if they and if they start coming this way then it's just something to be mindful of so i'm going to pop that one back in there 
because I don't want to lose all those drill bits everywhere. And then the last one that I ordered, this is the larger one. This is the 50 by 70, I think. 50 by 40, sorry, not 50 by 70. 50 by 40, and this is, if I can get this open, this is back to a poured glue as well by the looks of things. This one is a another landscape one. How beautiful is this? This rainbow of birds. So again, we have a nice white background. So again, full kit. Um, but how beautiful is this? Again, oh, we've got some more baggies in this one as well. Um, so yeah, this one is another round. These are all round uh, kits by the looks of things. I didn't really notice on there um, whether it said round or square drill, so and I'm not really, I'm not, I'm not really worried. Um, I did get on much better with the round drill, so um, perhaps that's not a bad thing. Um, so we have our um, whites. There are uh, 19 colours in this one. I so said it's a poured glue, nice and sticky. And these are the colours. This is going to be a rainbow, isn't it? Look. Oh, my goodness me. So we have some purples, some yellow. See, nice full packs. And even if they are partial, you get a nice big pack, making it easier to be able to cut it open. So if I had the half packs, you try and cut it open and guaranteed there's some that are going to escape. Having that bigger pack just means it's a little easier. So we've got some purple, some pink, some yellow, some orange, some blue, some green, lots more orange there. And then back round we go. And then the white along with those are the background for the background anyway. So um, this one I'm really excited to do because of the, um, the colours in it. So this should be a lot of fun. I don't need to, you know, individuals, I don't need to pop those back in. So I'm just going to wrap these back up in the canvas and pop that back in its bag so yeah that is the all of the um the kits that i bought i bought nine in total um because i mean they're cheap as chips and also um they were like three pounds something and also i had a 30 percent off code with shein as well so um it then made it even cheaper and then because i'd got my order up um a, to over a certain amount also meant free shipping so um happy days and yeah these are budget friendly kits and um you know i'm not necessarily thinking that they're all going to be um top quality but we'll see you get what you pay for at the end of the day and i do it for the process and not necessarily always for the final piece so here's everything that i bought from um Chien. and yeah if you've got any recommendations as to what to do with these then let me know and um thanks very much for joining me if you have enjoyed today's video please give it a thumbs up if you're new here i'd love you to subscribe and i'll see you all in the next video bye